So here's a lie calculator that is uh, given out on the website by SoapGuild.org. I've looked at a lot of them, and this seems to be the easiest to use, the most basic laid out one, especially for beginners. Um, this is one I've always used. Uh, here you can put in a name for your soap if you want. You can also put in a description for your soap if you want. Choose your measurements, pounds, grams or ounces. I always use ounces because it's easier for me. That's the scale that I've got that I measure all my oils when I measure them out. Your calculation, I usually go by amount of oils used. If you want, you can go by percentage of each oil. I personally like the amount of oil used. Choose your lye type. I always buy sodium hydroxide, NaOH. You can find that in most hardware stores like home hardware in Canada. It's usually in the pool maintenance area. Lye is a naturally occurring substance. You can actually make it yourself using wood ashes and water. It's time consuming and tedious, so it's just easier to buy it. Step two, select your oils. Let's see, a little bit of castor oil, and it's all in, in alphabetical order. A little coconut oil, lard, and olive pomace oil. Perfect. Enter the amount of oils. I said I was going to do mine in ounces. Castor oil, you're not going to put too much of that in there. Uh, say two ounces. Coconut oil, say 20 ounces. Lard, 10 ounces. And olive oil. Say I'm just emptying the last of my olive oil out of the bottle, so we'll say... 8.23 ounces and it will take that all in additional oils if you've got other oils that were not on that list this is where you'd add them you need to figure out what the sap value is I'm not sure how to do that so I've never done it additives this is where you'd add whatever else you're gonna put in there like essential oils or flower petals whatever you want I don't usually do that. It doesn't change how much lye water you need to put in, so this is just for the lye. Your options, I always say show directions just in case. You can have don't show super fat options, specify the super fat percentage if you get more into this and have figured it out more, or if you're new, just show the possible range. I have show possible range on all of them. Hit calculate. This is where you'd see that you now have 40.23 ounces of uh, oil total, and it's listed in order that you selected them in that list. Castor oil, coconut oil, lard oil, lard and olive oil. As for the super fat, that is basically how much oil is not processed by the lye when you mix it in. 0% would make a really hard bar. 10% would make a really soft bar. I usually keep it around 2%. So when you take 2%, you can see what the per ounces are there. Then you go down to 2% here. So this would say that you need, for that those oils and that amount, you'd need 6.297 ounces of lye and 12.6 ounces of water. And that will show you, you mix that and always add the lye to the water. Never, ever, ever add the water to the lye. Wear goggles and gloves, be safe, and have fun.